All right. Hello. I am uh, back on Man of War for a video. I'm trying to. This is mostly just to record evidence, but there's a glitch that one of my friends had regarding uh, Men of War. And it's on this map with these two factions. He was playing as America. And he was using a mortar. And that mortar was hitting near targets. Like I'd say, you know, an American, American Ease, would say like five feet away from them. Maybe even less than that. And the mortars were just not killing these group of SS Panzer Grenadiers. We're using the Valor mod with uh, Unforgotten and Operation Lobazon. So I'm going to see if I can figure out if that is more than just him having that issue or if I'm going to have the same issues as well. I, I should have it on all the exact same settings as him because the, the AI was normal and all that stuff. <laughs> now my friend who does um, play Men of War sometimes, mostly with other people, he it is uh he's not a big fan of the game. So this is where it happened too. I'm going to get some uh I'm, I might get some uh some elite marksman. But this is where it happened. The specific video I remember he was mortar he was suppressing this position with the mortar. You know, right here. And then there is a Panzer Grenadier up against these this fountain right here. And he took like three mortar shells and wouldn't die, and he was eventually put down by a M2 HB. Which is kind of ridiculous. And it took a 50 cal to put that German down. That is ridiculous. And he's not a. I don't know, I'm pretty sure I already said it, but. He's not a big fan of the Valor mod, which in some respects I can see why. Yes, sir. Got it, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So the plan for now is to set up a defense and the secondary, the main objective is to get a mortar, which it was an 81 millimeter mortar, so yeah, standard M1, 81 millimeter. I'm kind of worried, the Germans haven't sent out any units yet, I would have seen them by now. This is like actually nervous. There's something supposed to be happening. But there's nothing happening. It feels really wrong. What is going on? Yeah, they have an AI player and I have airborne, so there's no reason why there shouldn't be any enemies nearby. This is weird. Got it, sir. Wanna try taking the points? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This is strange. I don't know why there's no Germans being deployed. My only guess is that they're saving up. Possibly for some sort of mechanized unit. Because the AI will save up sometimes. I'm, I've seen them do it. Multiple, countless times they've tried to save up. This guy has a bayonet on his rifle. I've, I've never seen that before. That's interesting. I can almost get the mortar. I can now get the mortar. 
for the mortar, I'll put it right here. So I have complete area domination. It's been almost four minutes, and there's still have been no hostile German forces on the uh, approach to the north. Um, maybe maybe I have to restart it. Did something go wrong? Maybe. These are all the settings, which I'm pretty sure what is, um, what if I just cha leave that on medium units only? Will that change this? Let's try. Alright, roughly we're going to do the same strategy we did beforehand. Same elite marksman. Maybe this time I'll save up for a mortar first, then get a machine gun. Okay, I lied. I'm getting a conscript. Yes, sir. Now, another complaint he said he was having, which, I mean, I think this was before the mortar incident, is that all the um, AI, or all the soldiers, have, like, pinpoint accuracy. Still nothing's happened. This is weird. Right, that's it. Let's move out. Something that should have come. happened by now. Got it, sir. I guess I'll go investigate. I sent Eric Morgan to go look what's going on on the northern, northern front. We're itching to fight. Already on that, sir. Got it, sir. This is strange. I have not seen any German forces. Yes, sir. Um, Am I not on the right settings? No, assault zones, that usually works with the AI. I'm gonna leave everything as it is right here. And we're going to try it like this. Yeah, now it's warm in the house. Heater's on.
This is some bullshit. Where the fuck are they? Three games. That, that is a big little place. I kind of forget how extravagant buildings can be in Men of War. Large manor overlooking this entire area. Gives it kind of like an old medieval vibe. Oh, this is some weird shit. They're not spawning in. And I don't understand why. What if I get on the German side instead? The yeah, active spawn and stuff is the Germans. The Germans regular infantry is actually better than the uh Where do the Germans spawn? They spawn in this corner like I thought they did. With the Germans will kind of follow and sue with their tactics. Their tactics is just revolved around this entire machine gun. So we'll get these machine gunners and set them up with the middle bridge. And these are the units that my friends were having. My friend was having trouble with was the uh, Pandragonadiers. I call them the SS Pandragonadiers because in Valor, they are like legitimately the SS. Because I swear I've seen their insignia on them. Let me try and get a good look. Maybe I was wrong, but I swear I've seen it before. Yeah, I can see it. It's very small, but I can see it. Okay, yeah, there, there they are. Weird. They are aggressive too. Oh God. Alright, so, we've been, um, this AI is kind of scary, they, they're they already taking both points and they have a jeep with a machine gun on it. I'm going to try and retaliate against that jeep with my own Kubelwagen. So we're going to move on the eastern position, or a uh, point C, whatever it wants to be called. Try and suppress it with the Kubel wagon. Because that's really the only thing I'm seeing possible at the moment. I got this center bridge as well covered as I can possibly get it. I know there's a normal regular squad over here. There's. What do they have? Soul squads. Everything's quiet again. We're gonna send up a uh, FG-42 uh, LMG gunner. All right, they're back firing. Where are we getting suppressed? What the hell, guys? You cannot hit. Son of 
son of a bitch. Whoa. A Thompson immediately hit that guy? What? Bro, why are they why are there so many of them? That makes no sense. All right, we're getting a flamethrower. Cuz there should why is there so many? They outnumber me by such a vast majority. Even if this, even if it is supposed to be like fucking uh, real life or some stupid shit, this is ridiculous for game balancing reasons. Like, sure, I, I did, you know, in all fairness, I had a very much smaller squad, but what the hell? Oh, there it goes. Good God, they're gone. Wowzers. They have another goddamn Jeep and an M20. That has some range on him. And he's dead. M20. As much as I would like to test out the mortar, they're sending in some uh, some rather heavier vehicles. So I have to retaliate with all my own vehicles. When can I get a mortar? If I can find the mortar. 250? Not soon. This looks should secure the uh, eastern flank, though. Avenge this Panzer II we lost. That machine gun is ridiculous. God damn. Oh shit. I can't get a rifleman. That is some bullshit. Are you fucking serious? God damn, bro. Really? I hope that killed him. It didn't kill him. You died? How did you die? Now I'm remembering how agitating this game can be sometimes. Please just shoot him. Come on, just keep rolling, keep rolling. Set up. Rain hellfire. Oh. Great. He. Who? What is that guy? He's an assault rifleman. He's mid at best. He one tapped my guy. Are you serious? Oh, there's that stupid bazooka. Please, no, no, no. Come on, jump. Jump! Bro, are you slow? I that was actually pathetic. Why did it take you that long to do that? Shell that position. They're going to win simply because I can't do anything. I can't even spawn in my regular guys. Like, I can't spawn in a... I 
I said shell the position and you guys retarded. I didn't know we were already recruiting the fucking crippled. Oh. Yeah, that's fucking great. Okay. There's two. That's just gross. What is this accuracy, brother? Wait, bazooka guy. Awesome fucking sauce, bro. Awesome sauce. Are you fucking serious? That's a ranger squad. Bro! I hate the controls sometimes. A Sherman? Really? Come on, bro, really? Oh, you're gonna die now. Well, you at least killed the Sherman. Damn, this mod is bullshit. Holy gods. I I'm gonna lose now. This is bullshit. God damn. I can't even get a... Realistically speaking, what the actual fuck was I supposed to do? Because from what I just saw from that, it would just get fucked. Like, that was the entire game for me. Like, I'm actually... What do you do in that situation? Let's try again, I guess. Hold on, let's see how long this video's been going on for. 24 minutes. Let's do one more game, I guess. That's some fucking bullshit what happened though. Like really? Are you serious? Right, hold on, I'll be right back. Alright, we're we're back on. Let's try this again. This time I guess I'm just gonna get assault infantry, because apparently assault infantry work well enough. Do wish I could get some money a little bit faster. You know, military points would be good. Still, that is utter shit, though. Like, why the hell do they get, like... I don't know. It just feels, like, wrong. And, you know, what's even worse is I can't even get 
my SMG or rifleman as standard soldiers, so I have to go up to the next best thing, which is the Kyothic of Air 43, which, you know, isn't inherently bad, but it's not what I would have wanted. Because, you know, it's more expensive and all that. Anyways, to uh, try and stop the Shermans, we're going to go ahead and get some guys with, uh, you know, um, Panzerfaust near the village where they came from last time. And to try and secure this point, I'm going to put some riflemen down. I'm really starting to think it's randomized how the AI goes. Either that or it just doesn't like these settings. Or something. Because now they're not spawning again. Last time they were immediately coming. Oh, they're coming now. I hear their trucks. They got mechanized. Are you serious? Okay. Come on, come on, come on. You guys suck so much shit. Ow! Please heal? Oh shit. Son of a bitch. The window. Punch him. That works too. We need more Panzerfaust. Did you use your Panzerfaust? No, you didn't. Bro, what the actual fuck? No way in actual hell that that thing, out of all the possible vehicles, went through a wall like that. It is a jeep! Is that how weak this architecture is? Weak enough a jeep can go through the damn wall? Oh, and that's a Greyhound. You, Mr. Panzerfaust. Time to do what they call guerrilla warfare. Panzerfaust. This is so cheesy for the Germans. Just spamming these Volksturm with Panzerfaust. You know, if there's a chance that they do die. Please shoot him. Faster. Not him. I mean, good, good kills, but, you know, a little risky. Alright, let's uh, reinforce the line. 
What's this? More, really, what are they, rangers? Oh yeah, they're rangers, all right. Son of a bitch. Get some paratroopers, maybe? Maybe they'll stop these guys? Because so far, my entire squad is just, um... Mark that son of a bitch. What the hell? Bro got murked by a fucking Volksturm. Good shit on. You're so ass. Okay. Time to restabilize the line. Oh, he died. Rest in peace. That Volksturm. That man was a, uh... He deserves the Iron Cross for his services. He took out an M8 Greyhound and a, uh... Flamethrower. Now, he didn't really save anyone's life. They all died before that could happen, but you know. He should still be rewarded for his actions for the Fatherland. These guys are probably gonna run- No, they're in the point. They shouldn't run out of ammo. Probably a bad idea to move them, but we're gonna try anyways. Oh, my, I'm actually out of CP. He hasn't shot. This is actually so good. Frag those motherfuckers. That could have been better. Bro, what do you do? They threw it back! You got the grenades, duck! Probably shouldn't have used that out of all the grenades, but you know. Germans go kind of crazy, not gonna lie to you. That's a Sherman. Who are you? Oh, you're just a. F that shot saved the Reich. My god. Oh god, we, we've secured it. We've got this in the bag now. So what I learned from this experience is in Valor, the assault squads are a lot more efficient than they used to be. Than they are in the uh, normal game. And the uh, Fallschirmjäger have actually proved pretty good too. Their Fallschirmjäger FG42s are really good because they have scopes on them. No one's scarier than a weapon that shoots machine gun ammo than one with a scope on it. We're well, not machine gun ammo, it shoots rifle ammo, doesn't it? Auf Alfenhalm. Who knows what that man said? Not me. Is that the assault squad leader? He's dead. Come on. Victory! Alright. Ten minutes later and we won. My, my best um, infantry, my best infantry, or my best units were AT Infantry, Assault Squad Leader, and Volksturm. Yeah, that sounds like an average day in the 1945. We lost only 20 guys, and they lost 56 infantry and two vehicles. 
In further detail, two assault squad leaders led to the death of 12. One AT infantry led to the death of three in a vehicle kill. Six Volksturm, which were all armed with Panzerfaust, bundled up to up to three infantry kills and one in, uh, one vehicle kill. That was all by that one guy who blew up the Saghound, which is nice work on his part. I mean, all in all, our guys did pretty good. Um, here before I do any more of that. Let's go to multiplayer, not internet. Replays. Because I want to look at this one. How good was the mortar? Uh, we will never know. From what, I, well, from what I'm seeing, though, what I can come down to is that the mortar just isn't very good. Unless you get a heavier mortar. Maybe I'm wrong. It definitely helped with suppression, but overall it just really was not that good. That I could never, I was too under stress to actually use the damn mortar. So, I just don't think it's worth it in Valor when you're doing these smaller games. Mortars may be worth it long term, or if there's more than one player, but a battle like that, it's not worth it. And, uh, you know, that concludes this video.